even before we talk we create an impression based on how we look we might have heard this line hundreds of times from our childhood first impressions are the last impressions in many cases this is true to a certain percentage but when it comes to job interviews it is 1000% true because we might not get another chance let us face the truth people judge us based on how we present ourselves but unfortunately this prominent skill is not taught in our schools as human beings we are subconsciously wired to like have confidence and trust the people who present themselves well and that is exactly what we want our recruiters to feel about us thanks to the pandemic and video calling apps we don't have to go to the gym to become fit or we don't have to buy costly clothes or luxury watches to impress someone with minimal changes to our environment we can look better in our video interviews by the end of this video i will show you how can you leave a great impression from looking like this to this please bear with me for few minutes with this video quality i promise it's going to get better in the virtual world luxury is not defined by what we are wearing but by the quality of our video and we all know laptop cameras suck at delivering good video quality so buy a webcam on amazon for few bucks and stick it to your laptop head well not to brag but i am a privileged apple ecosystem user that's why i will use my iphone's continuity camera with the help of this plastic mount and i will stick it on my camera and voila we just improved our video quality a quick secret here i use this setup for all my youtube videos even if the camera quality is average the next thing is going to make a world of difference in making you look like a pro have you ever noticed when we take pictures while the sun is rising or while the sun is setting they look great it is because of the soft sunlight lighting plays an important role in making us look better in the videos the first source of light is called key light it can be sunlight from your window or an artificial light like this if you are using the sunlight as your main source of light make sure you close your windows with white curtains so that it reduces the harsh light on our face because i'm shooting it in the night let me turn off all the lights now i have turned on my key light and see how it focuses on my face it is placed 45 degrees from my face and the light is coming from the top and see how it adds this nice shadows to one side of my face making it more dynamic now that the background is very dark let's turn on the practical lights see how background is elevated but on the other side of my face this is getting mixed in the background so let's add a backlight As you can see this light is separating me from the background and creating that interesting small detail of light on my face and this is how we light ourselves to make it look pro and very dynamic but still something is missing right in the interviews it is important to make sure a face is always in focus and nothing distracts us like for example somebody coming in the background or this shirt i'll show you now when i change this shirt how suddenly my face becomes elevated wearing plain shirts with neutral colors like black white or beige or brown automatically brings focus to our face and to reduce the background distraction let's add that blur from our video calling software you see overall the look has changed from this to this As I said at the start, first impression is the last impression. By following these tips, you can create a lasting impression on your recruiter. Did I impress you with this video? But 
it is very sad to see that 60% of people are watching my videos without subscribing so please click on the subscribe button it helps my channel grow thank you this is tarun josh signing off